I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez and God has called and commissioned me to preach the good news of the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. My dear friend, I encourage you as I share a message with you and I pray for you today. Be in agreement, connect in faith, believe and you shall receive in the name of Jesus. Sometimes all you need to do in order for you to receive your breakthrough is praise God. I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez and that's what we're going to be speaking about today. I know, I trust, I believe you are blessed and you're going from glory to greater glory. I greet you in the name of Jesus. It is so good to be with you today, my dear friend. From wherever you're tuning in, it is so good to be with you. Please comment down below in the comment section and tell me where you're watching from. I want to know, I want, I want to pray for you, I want to pray for your country, I want to pray for your community. Our God is good, our God is gracious and he is merciful. My dear friend, I've said it and I'm going to say it again. Sometimes all you need to do to receive your breakthrough is praise God. The Bible says in the book of Psalms chapter 67 verse 3 to verse 6, it says, let the people praise you, O God. Let all the people praise you. O let the nations be glad and sing for joy. For you shall judge the people righteously and govern the nations on the earth. Selah. Let the people praise you, O God. Let all the people praise you. Then the earth shall yield her increase. God, our God, our own God, shall bless us. My dear friend, there is something powerful about praise and there is a connection between having God come and bless you and praising God. You see, those people who usually decide and purpose to live a life of praise are usually blessed people. People who purposefully decide to live an unusual life of praise are usually blessed people. They are blessed because they know the secret of praise. You know, the Bible says, enter his courts with thanksgiving, enter his courts with praise. Praise is also one of the fastest ways into the presence of God. If you live a lifestyle of praising God, you'll be constantly in the presence of God. You enter into his presence by praising him. So praise him all the more and the blessing shall abound all the more. Praise him all the more and the land shall produce its harvest. Praise him all the more and that business shall produce the right figures. Praise Him all the more and that marriage will turn around. Praise Him all the more and you'll see a change in your life. Praise Him all the more and you'll see a deliverance in your life. Praise Him all the more and you'll see that trial turn around. Praise Him all the more and you will see God do what only He can do. Praise Him all the more and you will see God's deliverance power. Praise Him, praise Him, praise Him. Let the nations praise Him and then the land shall yield its increase because God, our God, will bless us. In saying that, let's go into a time of prayer. We're going to begin by praising God. And as we begin to pray, I know God is going to bless you. So in saying that, let us begin to praise Him. Father, You are our God and we just praise You. We glorify Your holy name. We magnify Your holy name. We lift up Your holy name. You alone are holy. You alone are worthy. You alone deserve the glory. You alone deserve to be lifted up, be glorified and be magnified in my life and in my dear friend's life. Wherever my dear friend is watching, do what only you can do. Touch, change, heal, deliver, and take my dear friend to a greater glory and a greater altitude in you. Do this for the glory of King Jesus. I pray this in Jesus' name. I thank you for your grace that is released today even as we seek you. I thank you for your grace that never runs out on us. And even as we seek you and we press in, more grace is released. We give you praise and thank you that your presence and your grace is available to us, and your joy is new every morning. We give you praise and thank you that weeping may last for the night, but joy comes in the morning. We give you praise and thank you that you have given us the power to praise you, and we will use that power to praise you and to lift you up, even in the darkest times, like Paul and Silas did when they were in the prison. They decided to praise you, and there was suddenly an earthquake and the gates opened up and they were free. We praise you. We give you all the glory. We lift up your name. We have purposed in our heart that we will live a life of praising you. And this is all to your glory and the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. 
In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. My dear friend, God is good, God is gracious, God is merciful, and He's a good God. Now, we're going to go into a time of prayer. We're going to begin to pray, and even as you begin to pray, I want to encourage you to do three things. The first and the most important is welcome the Holy Spirit. Say this out loud. Say, Holy Spirit of God, I welcome you. Come, Lord Holy Spirit, come and touch me. Help me to pray. Help me to press in and help me to receive today. Help me to praise the Father. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. My dear friend, the second thing that I want to encourage you to do is to comment down below in the comment section and agree with me. There is so much power in agreement and even as you comment and agree, God is going to bless you. The third thing, if you've got a prayer request and you want me to pray with you and for you, simply go to my website, go to www.gabrielfernandezministries.org and click on daily prayer list. Fill in your prayer request, click submit. It's going to come through to me and I'm going to trust God with you. But in saying that, let us begin to pray. Father, I just pray for my dear friend. If my dear friend needs a miracle, as my dear friend decides to praise you and begins to praise you, do what only you can do. Touch, change, heal, deliver and set free, my dear friend. If my dear friend is sick in their body, let this power to heal the sick be transferred through right now. And let my dear friend be healed from head to toe. We cancel every disease that comes with the death sentence in the name of Jesus. We cancel every attack of the devil on my dear friend's health. And Father, I pray for a divine turnaround within 10 days. Within 10 days, let there be a turnaround. From this situation where it looks like it's going down, let it turn around and begin to go up. In Jesus' mighty name, we release power, 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 power that is available in the name of Jesus. The power in the name of Jesus to go forward and to heal that body, to heal that disease, to quench that fire, that fire of darkness, and to light the fire of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name, my dear friend, receive a miracle, receive jobs and better jobs, receive promotion. Even as you're trusting God, receive promotion. In Jesus' name, receive a job if you don't have a job. And may that business succeed. Father, I pray for businesses. Everyone who is an entrepreneur who has tuned in to this special broadcast today, as they are trusting you for that business to do well, even in this time, it's difficult in this time. But Father, let my dear friend make 100, 200, 300, or even 400 fold profit, even in this season. And this shall be a testimony that it is all to your glory. In the name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. I release such a blessing over you, and I decree and declare this deliverance is permanent. In Jesus' name. For myself, Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez, God bless you and God bless your family. I apply the blood of Jesus over you, and I'll see you again tomorrow. In saying that, my dear friend, we come to the end of this video. If you are blessed by this video and you feel led to donate or to partner with us to support us in this work that we are doing, then you can do so through PayPal or Patreon. All the links are provided in the description. Until next time, God bless you and goodbye.